These are testimonies and uh, amazing opportunities to put on Soap This, and you are? My name is Debbie Miles. Hi, Debbie. How long have you been going to soap opera events? Well, I just moved here from New Hampshire last month to Lago, so this is my first Young and Restless event in Florida, so I'm very excited. Oh, yes, I've been to many Days of Our Lives events. You know, they would come to Boston, and I went to Atlanta a few times, so I'm really excited about this. So, uh, I know that you've been, have you watched the Young and Restless? Yes, probably 30 oh, years. Yes, years. yes. Amazing. And uh, also, what has been your favorite memory of going to soap events? Just how everyone is so friendly, and it's such a nice community of fans, and you know, a lot of us keep in touch, and it's just, it's really nice. That's really cool. So, you heard about the soap This Cruise, right? No, I haven't. Oh, it's coming up in April, and Patty has put together a soap opera cruise oh. on the Carnival Conquest in April, and it's going to be a fun, fun uh, sailing from actually Miami to Nassau. Very nice. I'll look into it, but I have a Rick Springfield vacation in May, so, ah, uh, yes. He was my first interview out of college in broadcasting. Oh, well, I love him. Once he started doing fan vacations, how I got into Days of Our Lives was I met Eric Martzoff on one of his cruises, okay. and he's like, you have to, you know, watch Days and all this, and that's where it started. It started. Yes. You know, I remember with Rick Springfield, he brought his mother over, and he said, I've oh, never mother, done this. Yes. Yeah, he brought her on camera, and he said, this is a first for you, Dawn, and that was a memorable experience of just coming out of college when yes. we had a rounded about Orange County News. <laughs> oh, that's really nice. Yes, he's just, he's great. Love him. Amazing. Well, we're going to have some fun. I hope you got some ticket giveaways here. Yes, I got And some we're going to try to get them coming in live, and I'm Dawn Reese, 106.1 FM, The Heat, and thank you so much for being here. Oh, thank you. There you go. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Hi, I'm Dawn Risa. This year's Miss Classic, here we go, Miss Florida Tourism. Also, talk show host 106.1 FM, uh, six stations on Friday night, 8 p.m. And I'm interviewing some soap opera fans, and you are? I'm Robert Gregg from Pittsburgh. Hi, Robert from Pittsburgh. So what brought you all the way down to Soap This? Well, I am in the Young and the Restless fan club, and I heard about this on Twitter. And I thought it would be a chance to uh, meet some more of the people. I didn't get to meet as many as I wanted in Burbank in June. Ah, yeah. so that's so cool. So you're here. And, and what do you like most about the Young and Restless? Do you have a favorite? Uh, I like the way that uh, it seems like the stories they do are um, pretty relevant. and. Right. Um, yeah, and I, I like the, the people on it. It seems like they care about the fans and like they all get along. And, That's yeah. so cool that you're here because a lot Thanks. of people didn't realize this is here in Clearwater, Florida. It's so gorgeous here. And the yeah. opportunity to meet soap opera stars and, you know, get some maybe great gifts if your number's yeah. called. Yep, I have a raffle ticket, so we'll see how right. that goes. What's your social media? Um, I mean... Are you on... Facebook, Twitter? Yeah, I do Facebook and Twitter. Okay, so, you don't um, have to give it. No, I, I think I'd rather just... That's fine, <laughs> but you're here as a fan, yeah. and so what has been the most memorable experience that you've ever had meeting a soap opera star? The most one that stands out in your mind? Um, I guess when I met Christian LeBlanc in uh, Burbank, and um, he was just um, genuinely nice, and when he was talking about how... Um, he does it for the fans, and that was good. And um, how, uh, yeah. Well, excited just, that you're here and giving a testimony, yeah. and then uh, enjoy. There's some great food over there, and and have fun. That's yeah. what it's all about. And, okay. en Thank and enjoy you. Clearwater Beach. I hope you get some time to get oh, to the yeah, beach. That sounds great. There you go. Thank uh, you. Number one beaches in the world, Clearwater, Florida. Right. Thank <laughs> you very much. Yeah. Bye. Bye.
this was the best event I've been to. It really was. You got a lot more time with the people. Um, it was a lot of fun. And then, and then yesterday's event, and then the dinner last night, and then today with breakfast. Okay. Yes, we oh, did it all. Wonderful. <laughs> we did it all. We ate our way through the area. <laughs> it was wonderful. It really was. And everyone was just so nice. Wasn't it amazing? It really was. Yes. So any any anything that you learned from the soap stars? Not that I'll show you. <laughs> see, see, you have to come to the next Soap This, Soap This, and go to Facebook and add them. I mean, you're beautiful. What is your name? Come over here. Just look at the camera. I'm Rhonda. We can't see you, Rhonda. Come over here. Hi. Hi, Rhonda. From New Hampshire. Yes, also from New Hampshire. Wonderful. My little sister, and I'm Ange. Very cool. Well, we're so glad that you're here with Soap This, and we'll see you at the next event, ladies. Have a Absolutely. great day. Absolutely. Safe travels too. back home. Thank you. Bye-bye. Barbie with Soap This, and you're listening to Hollywood Connections with Don Reese. That's right, and go to Soap This on Facebook and like their page and see what they're doing. Thank you so much, Don. Thank you. I'm here with the amazing Barbie, and she also is with Mary Kay, so if you need Mary Kay, this is where to go. And tell us about the event from yesterday to uh, last night to today, how amazing it was. Uh, the cast of Young and the Restless is always so wonderful to work with. They're so professional and they're so much fun. Yep. So if you didn't come, you missed out because um, the luncheon was great. It was a meet and greet and um, ask questions, question and answer. And they're so candid and they love their fans. The Young and the Restless love their fans. And so um, if you have the opportunity to come again, if you have them here, that's what you to come. Um, in December, we're having Kathleen Gott and his friend Dr. Obrick yes. on General Hospital, and she loves her fans too. And the Vincent Irizarry, who is now going to be on Young and the Restless, but he was Dr. David Hayward, the evil Dr. David from All My Children Days. So come on out, come and join us. We'd love to have you. Yes, soapfist.ticketleave.com. I've been promoting this the last five months on the air. <laughs> yes, soapfist. Like us on Facebook. Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and we'll see you there. All right, bye. Thank you. Can I have